Hi guys, what's up? I was just reading in Proverbs today and I have been doing the one Proverbs every day and I'm a little behind but I'm today's my catch up day so I'm really excited about that but in Proverbs 5 um, it talks about avoiding fleshly desires I think that's so important in our day-to-day -day lives when we think well this is cool and everyone's doing this but we really need to realize that God has called us out of this world we are not of this world and he's called us to bigger better things and instead of following the crowd we could say hey well I'm not really I don't want to do that but in God's word if we really immerse ourselves in it and soak it up as much as we can we can really realize that when we are doing what God has called us to do and we're living in his life, it is so much better than the fleshly desires that we thought would be pleasurable at the time. But when we really think about it, it would be a setback in our relationship with God. So just really think about that this week and maybe read Proverbs 5 and just know that God has a better plan than your desires on this earth. He the devil knows your weaknesses and he's going to try to get you everything he can so just if you fall yourself if you feel yourself falling into that temptation just say a quick prayer and ask god for strength because with god we can overcome anything we can overcome the temptation to say a bad word or go hang out with people you know you shouldn't hang out so just really soak into that and just Pray for God's strength and he'll give it to you. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to say that today. Also, subscribe to our channel um, for more videos like this. I know they're not very long, but it's just a quick um, encouragement to you. It's also encouragement to us because by no means are we perfect at this. Um, and we don't have it all figured out. No one does. But... Spending more time in God's word can help you figure it out and it can help you really get into the routine of praying in your weakness instead of falling into temptation. Um, so yeah, my name's Kate, by the way, if you forgot or anything, but um, just give it a like and we'll see you later.